My name is Ariana Turner. I'm a sophomore at Archbishop Murphy and I play volleyball. I'm an outside hitter in DS, which is a defensive specialist, and my stronger side is the DS select passing. And I think my uh, strong suit is the effort I put out. In sixth grade, I never knew what volleyball was at the time. And my grandpa was like, you should try it. I think you'd be pretty good at it. And then I just fell in love with the game. Everyone says volleyball is not hard, but then like it is a hard sport if you want to be like really good at it. And I feel like I push myself to do it. And like I like being pushed to do better things. Of course, I want to play D1. So that's a really hard goal I'm going to have to work really hard at. It. And if that is not the case, I would be even glad to play like D2 or anything. So I met Ari Turner um, during summer coming into her freshman year. And I remember being impressed by her work ethic most. It caught me off guard. She's always brought something to our program from the minute she stepped in our gym. Um, and it's just been this genuine work ethic and um, selflessness. She's a feisty player. Um, she's very competitive um, with herself and within the game. Um, she has extremely high standards for herself, but she's motivated. She's always wanting to be a better player than the day before. She's extremely coachable. She receives feedback really well, even when it's stern. I'm a pretty coachable player. Like if my coach tells me to do something, like I'll try to adjust to like do it. And sometimes if it doesn't work, like if I keep messing up, then I'll get like down on myself. You know, but like I try to be open-minded and listen to everyone's opinion, but I don't like to be baby talk. Like I like it to be very straightforward and blunt. So the biggest difference between Ariana as a freshman and Ariana as a sophomore is we are finding the impact her voice has on the court. Um, she's been quiet over the last year. Um, she'll say things and they have a big impact, but now I think she's beginning to realize she has a lot to bring vocally to the court. And it's very supportive and it's holding her team to high standards while holding herself to high standards. I'm not really like, the most vocal, vocal person on the team. I'm kind of more quiet, but like, like I, my grandpa, he always sends me little motivational things and like always gives me words of wisdom. So then I take that to the team and I'll just say those. So I kind of like feed off his energy to the team. She is so fun and so bubbly, but when it's competitive game time, uh, you will see that stone face look um, because she, she wants it. She wants to win. She wants her team to be successful and win. I think it was the way I was like raised. I've like gr always grown up with like, got, like my brother and guys, and we would always wrestle around. Like I did wrestling when I was younger. So, like I used to always think that oh, no boys could ever beat me in anything. So like, I always wanted to be like the best at everything I did. So like, I still try to be the best at everything I do.